Two, Hello there everyone, it's Final Fantasy 6464 here, aka the Sephiroth of Let's Plays, and today we're going to be continuing on with our Crash Bash playthrough. So, in the last episode we had an hour's worth of rage, and hopefully we'll have a lot more dignified and nice and quiet in this episode. So, now let's go on to the um, Warp Room 4 after finally finishing Dot Dash, which took a lot of time doing that and now we'll be able to go on to the fourth world and start something new. Which is interesting. Right. Let's get over to here then. Okay. Right, so we're going to be doing sky balls now. So let's get started with that, shall we? In each of these episodes now I will be doing the Trophy, gem, crystal, and relic, so you'll have a lot more viewing entertainment per Three, video. Two, it may one, make it go into like half go. hours or whatever, but you know. <laughs> right, so we're gonna, so apparently the gimmick of this level is that uh, you arc around this thing and you also. And the, eventually, parts of the thing will break, and you'll also and you'll start to get the balls heading in that general direction. Luckily, it doesn't stay broken for very long. And compared to the uh, arena champions, this should be relatively easier. Namely, because you don't have to do twice in a row, I can lose one, it doesn't really matter. Apart from that, there's no gimmick, apart from, there's no magnet, there's no force field, it's just good clean running around in the sky ball. Coco just takes some punishment though. She has so many more lives than anyone else. We have to win three times, remember, so it's probably take a long time. Three, but at least it's not two, three times in a row, one, which is useful. Go. <laughs> right. I've been having a bit of a cold recently, so I might sound a bit weird. Probably not, but I might do. So let's get everyone down to low health but me. This is fan. I plan it, I really like that fan. I think it's really good if you can um, avoid things going into your goal even when the uh, force field is towards, I mean the, the field is facing you. So let's try and let's try and get Coco out of the picture first. So I think I prefer fighting the sides on this one, seeing as even if it goes down towards my side, I can still find the tiniest goal as easily as he can hit him with mine. This is the only thing that you see that the only corners are going to hit the floor. It's never going to have anything to do with uh, the actual X and Y axis and the other diagonals. Okay. I think I'm doing quite well on the R. Uh, on the whole, uh, just trying not to get all the balls everywhere into my goal. But, however, it does appear that uh, once again the force field is more down towards our side than the total side, so it's not good. Because I really want the person to die. But not 
to kind of a point in it. There we go. Now for it to go for the Yeah, there we go. One, one win for me. Awesome. Okay. Now there's two more times of that. I'm pretty sure this might be the last ball game. I'm not certain. Okay. I hope it is. Right, let's get this done then. Okay. I'm glad I don't have to do more than another video anymore. As well, it's not very crazy. I'd rather do all of one level in one video rather than keep trying to do lots of them just to get relics. When the relics are obviously the most important thing. But I'm interested to see what the crystal thing is going to do. The people is always facing your side or something like that. Oh, just so you don't, in case you know, I, I'm actually blind from this point, so I have no idea what to expect. I was semi fun before, I didn't remember everything, but... Ah. Me and Coco seem to be at war again. Coco is a bitch though, and she always seems to be like falling by one. For whatever reason, she really does shoot the balls and fall, I don't know why. Try and get the field full on well, Coco's side, that'd be great. Yeah. Have some of that. Have at you, bro. Okay, so let's, uh... Okay, come on. Gonna kill it. Yeah! Technically, I should have this now. I'm so far ahead. Coco is it? Yeah, not that. That's not what Coco wants. Yes, there we go. That's another win for me. There's nine nights. I'm barely under half, which is really good. I wonder if that would have won me the jam. Probably not. Okay, let's see. They're playing, they're playing tennis. Or Pong, or whatever. Okay, let's, uh, let's try and get over here. Coco needs to die, as usual. Plan: just kill Coco, and then everything else should be fine. Okay, so let's, let's try and kill them. Ah! Come on! Ah! Take that. Gotta get them killed. Go on. How about you? Come on, right. Okay, so they're dead. Okay. Die! Well, at that point, I think. Don't say things like that, though, because obviously then you start getting the LP cards and you can't, like, play for gravy. Okay. Let's try it. Yes, we really want things about the dino, that we can look at. Bottom right fan, please don't get please don't get out. There we go. Oh dang it, I like those alive, what the hell? Awesome. Okay. That's a win for me then. Just that. That's a trophy. Right, that's to do the gem, the crystal, and then the relic. 
I did win twice in a row just then, so hopefully it won't be that difficult, but the arena champions are known for being much more tough. Right. Okay. Looks like the time for gem. Gem mastery. 6,500,000. Okay. So let's, um... No, it wouldn't have won me in, but they only have 15, so... It might go one of two ways. Okay, so let's, uh... I'm going to go all the way pro. Here we go. That is not pro. But oh well. Basically, what I want to do is if I can get them to about my life without dying, then I should be in good stead to uh, win. Which is basically which is the plan. I just, I just want to make them all of my life, or my sort of life, and then I should be able to take it from there. Fair game again. The, the whole problem with these gem challenges is that obviously the odds are against you, so you don't. So you, of course, you're going to panic because you're like, oh my god, I'm so going to get killed. And that's the entire reason you die, because you panic about dying and then you end up messing up silly. Like, probably won't win this time, but I can try again. Okay, so. Coco is dead, but... Okay. Oh! Okay, we were closer. Wow, she has loads of life. She really does need to die. Not down my side. Down her side would be lovely. Class of, the, class of the bitches. Oh. Even if I somehow manage to take out Coco, which I doubt, seeing I have one life and you have 11 more life than me. Okay. No. Yes, this is why arcs are annoying. I, end up, I keep putting the balls backwards. Me and Coco have been absolutely hammered this game. Oh, okay, we both died at the same time. Okay. Finger down, tiny, getting ahead again. Yes, like then, it hits behind me, like clearly, like a square in front of me. Oh. Okay. Three, two, Luckily, one, I'm not like losing when I, no life and I'll have 15 still. That would be really sucky. Yeah! What? Oh, okay, they didn't go into mine. Awesome. But that was a bit weird. Full, like, friggin' blue. Ow, ah, 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 ah. How about them curves? Hey -ya! Take that, Coco. Hey, Tiny, have some balls. You need some. Part of a balanced breakfast. There you go. Hey ow, 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 ow. Yeah! Hey -ya! Stay out of my way. Okay. Although I did prefer it in like the olden ones where there's actually a, a reason for these random noises to make. Like you know when the lights above the thing would flash, so you, like that's what's making the noise. Like, what's making the noise here is it's some like random siren thing above, like a blimp that's going Bruh, ding, Bruh, bing, ah. That's what I think it is. Yes, okay, I was gonna say, come off it, that's clearly 
I had to win there, surely. Wait, so that's the gem. Wait. Let's move on to the Crystallis of the Crystals. Right. Crystal, please. Bing! That's what I thought. Okay. Avoid touching the special balls. These balls do not score. Three, two, one, go. What's a special ball? Um ah. So I've got to let the red ones go and play the game normally with the others. I suppose if I hit that I die, right? Yeah. If you hit the red balls you explode. Right. Awesome. I don't mind letting Ah did it. Yeah, see like there, I like, just about Yes, if you hit the balls you die. On my end. Ah, what are you doing? I saw it and like I, I told my brain to go right and I went, okay, then left. Into the ball. And went, Wah! Like that, I'm not so sure. Right, okay. Oh, that was just unfair. What what was I supposed to do there? It hit exactly sideways. What? No, they were so close to death. Yeah, yeah, it's just 10 lives worth of damage. Such as bad playing. Okay, so that was, again, it, it's always close, but it's not close enough yet. Wow. Lovely. Stop hitting them backwards. No. What? I, I just don't think. Sure, let the balls go straight through the comms, but they shouldn't be able to reflect them. That's just stupid. Point. Ah, oh, wow. Oh, he seized up on the controller. I think it's the one with the most uh, points. It has its side taken down, to try and be fair. But not something you can read, because obviously if it, it's like, like it, if I died and it changed every time. No! What was I doing? I was literally asleep at the wheel. I, I sat there, looked at my controller and went, Uh, okay, I'm just gonna stand still and not press anything. I think pressing something is better than doing nothing. Like, doing nothing's consigned yourself to- Oh, that's consigned yourself to death. Come on! But they choose not to because that would be cheap. Oh yeah, but I can't deflect the red ones. Like there! Now I could have moved to the left, it would have been absolutely fine, but I don't have the foresight to go, ah, he's going to hit it that way, it's going to be red, it's going to hit me. Because I just don't know. I had the foresight to move into that one. That was like an awesome person. Like there, like, I could have easily tell that that was going to be red, but they were both silver, and I don't know until they hit it. And by the time, if they're hitting it in that direction, towards me, by the time they've hit it there, I'm already too late. Oh, uh, yeah, I had absolutely no excuse for getting hit by that one, but course, I think is my inability to take my own failure. I literally can't accept that I fail at things. I, I want to be good and win at everything. I can't, I can't handle the fact that I die and the fact that I suck at things that I really shouldn't be sucking at. Like this, I should have won this ages ago, in my opinion. Like there, I should have moved out of the way to the right there. Like, again, in hindsight, I can say all these things, but at the time, I, I really don't think I could have moved out of the way in quickly, but... What are you going to do, eh? You've got to keep fighting anyway. Yes. Even if those, like, I, another thing, like, just just to make it fairer, like, I know you're supposed to avoid hitting the red balls and all... And I'm all talking about instant deathing you if you're supposed to avoid them, but... but even if they just take away, like, one life or something as opposed to ten, then I wouldn't mind so much. I can't, then again, I wouldn't try and avoid them so much if I only took away one life. You're like, okay, so if I hit this ball, I actually will just die and explode in a barrel of boiling top tar and death and blood and guts.
that dude telling me that I fail isn't helping. I know that I fail, I'm gonna keep trying. Ah, nothing I could have done about that. I was like literally on the right hand side of the screen. Like there, I would have expected that ball to curve towards the right hand side of my thing and not hit me. Oh, no, okay, like, yeah, fair enough, that, that ball would have hit me anyway, but still. I think in my personal opinion that I hit the, um, I hit the, I, well, I do hit them balls too much, but I look at the score too much. Right, so I've got to, hopefully, sorry for the shitty-ass commentary, but I'm trying to, really trying to concentrate. Because they can curve it in such a way that means that, I, that things happen like that. No! What we did I, exactly like there? What was I, what did I think that would have accomplished? I saw the ball going to bounce into the other one, so I moved to the right when I know that the ball is going to bounce towards the right. Like literally, like, I, I I got the perfect scenario there. Me versus Coco, like the one who barely ever hits me versus me, and the other two are dead, and I throw it away because I can't play. It's like I'm going back to bloody school and trying to learn how to do physics and momentum and stuff like that all over again, which is annoying, because I didn't like it the first time. Did that just hit me? Apparently not. That's a lot of red. Again, I think if I could bat away the reds, it would be a lot easier, but I don't think that, uh, I, d I don't think it would actually help me all that much to, like, do something stupid like bat it back into me or something like that, and then I get even more frustrated with myself because, like, the only person who kills me is me, which is not good, obviously. I want Tony, 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 I want Tony and Dongo deal to die. Right, um, yes, yeah, so I want Tony and Dingo Dale to die. That'd be great. Now that one hit me right, right on the noggin. So they don't ever blow up, ever. Yes, like, even when I, I'm, I'm really, really, really concentrating right now, and it doesn't make jack shit of a difference, or tense, and I... Like, there, I could have easily moved out of the way of that, and then sat, sat there like a bloody plum. Or move straight into it, that works too, but I probably would have died being over that side anyway. Right, that was a lot of red that I just saw then. It was like, all the balls on the stage were red. Which is a bit silly, like, there should be a cap to the amount of red balls you can have. Oh, they had like four health each! 10, 4, 4, and I had end up with 0, 4, 4 in one hit! Like that! I was expecting it to go down the left side, not down the right side! And now I'm dead! I have a habit of doing that, by which I mean knocking it into a place where I can't avoid. Yes, 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 yes. Thank God for that. Woo! That was exciting in a bucket. So I'm gonna edit all loads of death out, and that'll be awesome. Okay, relic time. Okay. Just gotta win twice in a row. Just gotta win twice in a row. It's fine. Where are the red balls? Embryo, Koala Man. I need to learn his name, but Koala Man and uh, Tiny. I'm already used to fighting Tiny. Where's the? I like the cool nighttime scene better. Even though the balls come with that, I just like the, I like the nighttime better. I like playing games at night, I don't know why. In terms of like, in the actual game, nighttime settings. Like nighttime races and racing games and nighttime adventuring platform games. This is cool. Awesome. And we're back from the grave doing some related things. 
crash bash. Things are going very quickly, what the hell's going on? How does Embryo still have 19 points? It's so weird. Okay. Okay, come on. Come on now. Come on now, Embryo, just die. Be, there. Be a good lad. Bottom left one, would you die, please? Thank you. No, the point was to hit Embryo, not me. Okay. So many balls! Ah! That's what she said. Ha ha ha. That's so funny. Right, okay. Uh, let's kill these guys. Ow! Oh dear. Ah! No. Ah! Oh. Okay. Gotta go again. But not well enough as it, it happens. Especially not to do things like that and then die. Oh. Cortex sandwich, and I wasn't invited. That was close, but I still got a win twice in a row, and I haven't won once yet, so that's one win for me. No! Zero, zero, one, zero! Are you kidding me? Yes, okay, that's one win. Now I gotta do it again. Three, two, one, Just gotta win one more time. Go. Come on. Once more. Come on. Not much to start, but it's okay, I can recover. We'll come from this. Okay. They seem to be playing uber well, which is frustrating. Because I prefer it when they play super bad. Of course. Right. Um. Okay. Tiny isn't playing great. Koala's playing quite well. I'm playing okay. Okay. Here we go. Koala and me need to have a little battle though. Battle for supremacy because he has a lot of life. The one thing I don't want him to have of is life. Okay, come on. Oh, we're all on to 10 health now, so this is once again going, going to be somewhat close. And once again, I don't really like close. This is one of those, one of those weird words. Close. Oh, I'd, I'd rather be far apart in my favour. Somehow managed to, to survive that onslaught when six of them easily could have all gone into my goal at once. We're down to a life of peace. Yes, and that is the win. One win down, and that'll be that for this episode after an hour and a half worth of recording. So now I'm going to go save and turn it off. And that Skyball's done. So hopefully, 
now that all the ball stages are done, I'll actually speed up things quite a bit from this point onwards, which will be lovely. I think this gives me like 4% or something per level now, I'm not sure. Don't remember, I don't remember what it was on before. Right, okay, so it's going to be Time Fantasy 64 signing off. Until then.